What's going on, guys? We're continuing on where we left off. We're still on the ship. Let's continue. This game is absolutely amazing. I miss it so much. I'm so glad that I'm revisiting old ones. You guys seem to be loving this. Uh, thank you for the likes and the comments on the last video. You guys are hammering out. I appreciate it so much that this series will be taking off. I'm so excited, especially Forgen. I know that series is going to be enormous. And I appreciate it, guys. Some fresh air might do me good. This is the second day. Yeah, this is the second day on the ship, I believe. So it looks like we can interact. We'll interact a moment to talk. Ah, a fellow Londoner. Good to see I'm not the only man of means aboard. Rupert Martin, pleased to meet you. Haytham Kenway. Pleasure. Seems we picked an excellent time to leave the city. Oh? You didn't hear about the murder at the Opera House? No. What happened? They're still trying to sort it all out. And I suspect they'll be at it for a good long while. Any word on the moat? They've ruled out robbery. So perhaps it was a business arrangement gone sour. Or something more personal, more lurid. Who knows? But I am glad to be away from it. The city grows more dangerous by the day. Hmm. We have no idea about that. Have a good day, sir. Good morning, Doctor. To you as well. A question, if I may. Do you serve aboard the ship, or are you simply taking passage? A bit of both, actually. I've been commissioned by the Royal Navy to study maritime illness. I'll be observing the crew during the journey. We have found that uh, sailors fare far better on the open seas than the rest of us. I hope to discover why that is. Well, I hope you are successful in your endeavors. As do I. Thank you for the kind word. You're welcome. Now, it looks like we play some game stuff, but uh, we're just not going to do that. We're gonna move on up deck. If we can't go this way, we have to go this way. But we're not playing any games. We could, but we're not. We're doing a story gameplay. Not to complete everything. Boston, Waterbury. I hope so not doing it. Captain? Mr. Kenway. I just wanted to thank you again for taking me aboard and apologize for any inconvenience it may have caused. Inconvenience would be an understatement. I'm sorry, I don't follow. My ship was held in port for two days that we might accommodate you. I lost several contracts as a result. I had no idea. Of course not. You nobles are all the same. Huh. Which, by the way, this is the son of... Uh, of the Sasuke 4 Kenway, this is his son, um, and then Connor is this guy's his son. And then all will be well. Are you sure about that? Of course. Have I ever led you astray? Nah. No, you don't stick right with the others. Have faith, my friend. You'll see. Well, well. Seems our esteemed guest has deigned to grace us with his presence. You might want to head back to your quarters. Top deck's no place for tender parnells. <laughs> so I thought. And yet here you are. Fancy yourself a joker, eh? Let's see how funny you find this. That's enough, Graves. Stay out of this. And to hell with you, Mills! Who started you on anyway? Oh, into the barrels. 
When ready to go again if you are. This is unwise. What is that? You think I'm afraid of you? No. But you should be. Do you need that? Never! How do you like these odds? What's the meaning of this? Captain! Explain yourself at once, Mr. Kenway! These thought we were simply passing the time with a bit of sport, Captain. How about you pass the time by doing your goddamn jobs instead? I wasn't aware I was paying you to loll about. A word, please, Mr. Kenway? Fuck. Oh, I nearly forgot. There's your knife back. <laughs> That's the history of the Kenways, by the way. I don't care for you, Mr. Kenway. I've had nothing but trouble since you came aboard. Your problems have nothing to do with me. I beg your pardon? You're a poor leader, ill-tempered and cruel, and it's clear your crew has no respect for you. <laughs> Parker, what you Look, said? I don't want to argue. In fact, I need a favor. Oh, this is rich. I suspect some of the men intend to mutiny. Really? What a surprise. As I cannot trust any of them, I am compelled to turn to you. Because you're drunk. And why should I help you? Because if they do intend to betray, I'm the only hope you have of reaching America alive. Well, what will it be? If what you say is true, what other choice do I have? Thank you. But let me be clear. Should you ever dare to insult or threaten me again, I'll not hesitate but to cut off your head myself. Are we understood? <laughs> Excellent. Good day. Such an asshole. I love it. I love these games so much. They're so great. Uh, I just want to thank you guys again for all the likes and everything you guys are pumping out for these videos. It's, it's fucking fantastic. I cannot be more than happy. I can't wait to play Origins for you guys. Hello, sir. Do you expect we'll have a pleasant crossing? It is a quiet time of year, though rogue storms and troubled waters are not unheard of. But no need to fret. At worst, they'll prove an inconvenience. I'm more concerned about pirates and rogue privateers. Have you encountered them before? Aye. But the Providence is a strong ship, and her crew well trained. They will surely keep us safe. So if I just stood here, would we make it to America? Because it doesn't seem like we're getting any farther away. Oh well, either way, I'm gonna go downstairs. Downstairs with you, the piratey crews. I think Assassin's Creed 4 was one of my favorites. I played a little Syndicate. I rented it, tried it out, and it was it was all right. But. Uh, I think that four was my favorite. It was four was a lot of people's favorites, so I'm really excited for this new one. But let's go ahead and get on. I think he's gonna go to sleep. We're gonna go to day two. Maybe. Bam! Cannon Blast. Yeah, these games are so good. So good. I advise any of you guys to go back and play them. You know, replay through them before playing the new one. You know, I highly advise it. Mr. Kenway. Captain. Whatever they're up to. I believe it's coming to a head. I'd best get to work. He 
just got our rations again. Claims we're not provisioned for such things. <laughs> You looking for another fight? That it? Go away. Assholes. Quite the base thing you gave Graves and Quill. Wasn't by choice. Hm. Aye. Blockheads, the both of them. Where are my manners? Louis Mills. Pleased to meet you. Atham Kenway. So, should I be watching my back? I think the boys learned their lesson. That they're normally not so nasty. Honest, it's just the past few crossings have been a bit rough. Oh? Captain's trying to cut costs, reduce rations, lower wages, more dangerous cargo. It's put the crew on edge. Is there cause for concern, then? Not if I can help it. But the captain needs to think about the way he treats his men. Hmm. So there might be a mutiny, there might not be a mutiny. We'll find out. We'll get to the bottom. You there! I have some questions for you. That's nice, but I ain't got time to gossip. Probably wouldn't have anything useful to share anyway. You want information? Try the cook or the doctor. Everyone's always chatting them up. Won't be serving for another couple of hours. Some biscuits in the barrel if you're desperate. Actually, I've come with a question. What's that? Have any of the men been acting strange recently? Said anything that struck you as out of the ordinary? The boys cry about the rations, as if there's anything I can do about it. But beyond that, I ain't heard much. My advice? Go find James. His ears are always open. And where might I find him? Right behind you, actually. He's the one sitting on the barrel. Mm-hmm. James. Hi. Atham Kenway. Pleased to meet you. I know who you are. I was hoping you could answer some questions. I figured as much, but not here. Follow me. So, what do you want to know? Have you seen or heard anything out of the ordinary since we left port? Anything that gives cause for concern? Some of the men have been gathering at night on the upper deck. I've only caught bits of their conversations, so I couldn't say for certain what they're up to. But I suspect it bodes ill. Is it a mutiny they're planning? All I know is they've little love for the captain. Mills has been trying to talk him down, but there's only so much one man can do. Thank you for the information. I only wish to see us reach the colonies alive. So do I. Evening, sir. How are things? Calm and quiet. Just the way I like it. What brings you topside? Thought I'd wander a bit. Stretch my legs. That's all. Take care where you tread. The deck hides all manner of danger in the dark. What was that? Someone's throwing cargo overboard. But why? Hmm. Sneaky bastard. Quiet! Here he comes. Make like you're working. 
He's got our rations again. Claims we're not provisioned for such luxuries. No one is based on land and a dark flag. Wine's eyes. They're leading a trail of the pirates. Most curious. How do you not know something's wrong, bro? Like, I would know something's wrong. He's throwing barrels overboard. Showing someone the way to move these ships. That was day 28, we're at 20, uh, 33 now. Any news? Each night it's the same. I scout one area, and they drop the painted barrels from another. I'm going to need to recruit an extra pair of eyes. Maybe James or Mills. Why are they doing this? Near as I can tell, the barrels serve as markers. They're leaving a trail. My fear is it's only a matter of time before whoever's following it. Ship sighted aft! She's making ready to fire! Beat to quarters, men! Ready the. Brace! Everybody down! A warning shot! Seems they don't mean to sink us, but board us instead! Man the cannons! Make ready to fight! I want you below decks! Why? Let me help you secure the ship. Do you know how to rig a sail? To load a cannon? To wage war at sea? I didn't think so. Now return to your cabin, or do I need to have you escorted? Fucking ass, Jax. Secure the hatch! Hey, Tim. Have you been topside? A ship's appeared and means to board us. It's strange. There's no sign of mutiny aboard. Doesn't make sense. Ah, but it does. What do you mean? Did you think you could escape from London so easily after what you did at the Opera? That we wouldn't notice? That we wouldn't follow? Ah. Oh. So that's what this is about. Surrender, and I will see that you are treated with honor. If you wish to treat me with honor, give me a sword. Are you sure this is how you want to play it? Cut down pretty fucking fast, dude. I told you to stay below decks. I did as you asked. Only Mills was there waiting for me. He's the one that drew that ship here. There was no mutiny. Only him. What do they want? Me. Then they can have you. Is that so? You'll catch us anyway. There's nothing to be done. I can think of something. You wish us to sail into the storm. It's our only chance. I won't do it. Then I will. All right. All right. Into the storm, motherfucker. Later, bad day. A few hours later. Hopefully, he hasn't joined us. We need those ropes secured! A lot of cuts. I told you this was bad. On yourself. I'll fix your sail for you. I do apologize that I did not. Uh, 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 
cutscenes, things like that. I do apologize. But this video is going to be a cutscene. The walkthrough is walkthrough. I promise to walk through that. Get off the rigging! Secure that tackle! That's been amazing being We need more speed! Loose the sails! Hate them! You take the foremast! Jane! To the main mast with you! I Batten down the hatches! Alright, so I'm gonna leave the video for now. Thank you guys for watching. If you did, hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe and share and comment what your guys' favorite thing was about playing Assassin's Creed 3 or any of the Assassins. Like, what your favorite feature was, what your most dislike was. And I'll catch you guys in the next video.